Last Thursday, the Winchester Film Festival held this final screening of Women, Life, Freedom, Part 2 called Whispers from Iran, at the Hampshire Record Office in Winchester. The festival was held to continue its commitment to screening films from countries and cultures where filmmakers face difficulties in showcasing their stories. The biggest challenge was getting certificates from the government because they usually they don't give us certificates for making films which is related to these kind of cultural problems, political issues and also which stories which is related to the religious. So it was my main concern, so I had to risk and send another story to the government to take the certificate and then make another story. The festival said this. This year, Winchester Film Festival continues its commitment to screening films from countries and cultures where filmmakers face tremendous difficulties creating films which tell their own stories. The screening included six intriguing short films from Iran, which left you thinking. These range from drama, animation, horror, war and comedy. Um, I'm quite interested in seeing Mirage because it's being debuted tonight and I've got to write a review, a review about it and uh, the director's here I think, so it'll be cool to see what they have to say about it. There's quite a few laws in Iran, quite difficult to release things. It's really good for people in Iran who want to become filmmakers, show them outside of the country, get their name out there. The Winchester Film Festival has done it again with spreading awareness on topics of those who are silenced in their own countries. Will the festival continue to do this and help spread awareness of those voices who are unheard? This is Alexandra Stapleton for Winnell News Online.